How's it off in Jankheads? I'm bringing you a brand new Minecraft update today, which I was not expecting to be doing. This surely came out of left field, right in the middle of 1.21, I think it was. As you can see, we're in 24W14 potato slash snapshot. You can also see here we are in the Minecraft Potoisonous Potasio update, also known as the Poisonous Potato update. Apparently, they have added an entire new biome, which I think is what we're seeing in the background here. Or no, not biome, dimension. A whole new dimension with, I assume, a portal and everything. So, I figured, I, I didn't want to look too far into it because I kind of wanted to go in blind. So we're going to go in blind today. I did do a potato test just to make sure it was working, and it did seem to be working. I didn't actually make it to the biome, though, or to the dimension, excuse me. So I'm excited to actually get into it. I don't know how you actually get there, but I guess we'll see. Let's start a new world. We'll call this the Jankato. Why does that, that seems just like Jankato. We'll call this the Poison, Poisonum Jankato. Yeah, sure, sure. Survival, normal, I guess we'll do normal. I assume we'll do all that, allow commands, turn that off, experiments. Uh, you know what? Might as well turn all those on. I think since this is a uh, brand fresh and new update, we might as well use all the experimental features just for fun. As far as world goes, I think default is all what we need. Bonus chest is on, which is interesting. Default on, I guess I'll leave that on. Might be a part of the update. Game rules, experiments, data packs. I think we'll leave all that the same. Let's get into it. I am very excited. This isn't... I'm pretty sure the world's just going to be the same. Yeah, okay. This is just... We just in Minecraft. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So, I presume we're going to have to just kind of explore around for now. I guess let's see what's in the bonus chest. Aha! What? What? Poisonous potato plant... Okay, we seem to have a mimic potato, and then the rest of these are normal. They're giving us all we need to start a potato farm is interesting. So, new recipes unlocked. Holy shit, that's a lot of potato-based recipes. Man, this update is huge. And wait, so, I mean, it's clearly like we're in the potato version of Minecraft, right? Like, this isn't... <laughs> It's not, we're not just going to have the potato update in normal Minecraft from now on, the potato dimension. I assume, I guess. Either way, this is very cool. Interesting spawn. Actually, a lot of ore right there. That's kind of sick. Might make use of that. Otherwise, savannah, jungle over there, kind of cool. All right, all right. Well, hold on. What's this poisonous potato plant do? Can I, like, click on it? No. Huh. I mean, it's a clearly a different item from the rest of the, uh... Oh! Uh, uh, well, well, well. It looks like you found us. Press space to acknowledge. On closer inspection. Okay, so I'm talking to the potato now. Hold on, this guy needs a voice. He's a potato. Uh... Whoa! Steady on your feet there, Duncor J. That's my Minecraft username. I'll just switch that to Jankum from now on. You're probably thinking, what's the deal with this guy? Oh, the talking potato man that's speaking into my brain? No, I, I'm not confused at all. I invite you to take a moment to consider my situation. Um, I found you in a box. You're a potato with a face. I think that's about it. We've been planning on... We've been planning on infiltrating Minecraft for weeks. What? Okay, so... <laughs> This is a full, this is a full lore experience. But all we could manage is sneak it into this April Fool's snapshot. Ah, right, <laughs> right. It is April first. My dumbass did forget, and now you've discovered us. Cool. I guess I'm a pioneer of sorts. Then, do you have any idea how difficult it is to write Java code? Frankly, brother, I could not have less of an idea how to write Java code, so no. Apparently you do, though, so that's cool. It's not as simple as copying samples from the internet. 
It's not? Okay, I'll take your word for it. Really, I, I have no idea. There's also a lot of pasting involved. Okay, okay, so he's a bit of a... We have a bit of a potato troll in our brain. Is he a parasite? A potato, a potato, a potarasite? Hmm. We had to write tens of lines of code by rolling on the keys and hoping for the best. Oh, right. Yeah, no hands and all that. Okay, so what is happening? <laughs> this seems truly insane. And now that I have finally infiltrated Minecraft, you pranced on over, picked me up, and plopped me on your head. To be fair, I was trying to craft you, but yeah, I guess I did I did do that. So uh, <laughs> I can't help but feel like I'm not on the wrong. I must say you have incredible balance keeping me up here. Oh, so you're just like sitting up there. Got it. Especially considering you're jumping so much. Well, that's the only way I can communicate with you. Why are you jumping? Are you being startled? Okay, a little bit of a Portal 2 type joke. I don't see much to be startled by around here. I don't know, bro. I don't know. These sheep are pretty spooky. Pretty spooky indeed. Then again, I have no eyes as I am a poisonous potato. Okay, sure. You know what? That makes sense. However, why do you have glasses? You know, that's kind of... That's not really adding up for me there, partner. So really, I'm not going to see much at all. Okay. Okay. Fair enough, I guess. Although the little sprouts grown out of me are also called eyes. Right. Little potato knowledge there. I'm going to try to actually get some wood here if I can. Perhaps if I squint hard enough, I can see where new recipes unlocked. Hold on, Minecraft, I'm trying to read. Where we're at. Oh, where we're at. We're in Minecraft. Um, yeah, that's kind of that's kind of that simple. Watch out, there's a block over there. Try not to be startled by it. Okay, now we're roasting me? This is a roast session now? You have a big pink nose and a mustache. You don't even have a mouth. <sighs> This, I, I, don't, I don't know how much I fuck with this guy. Maybe you need a moment to breathe and relax. This world is very startling after all. Alright, I mean, just because I'm a little scared boy and constantly I'm being jump scared by wood falling in my inventory doesn't mean you have to be a dick about it. If we can find a village, we could take one of those beds and rest. I suppose that's true. You want me to find a village? Let's find a Minecraft village, okay? Good. I thought for a moment you meant a real village, and I was going to get up out of my chair and go find one. But now, it, we, okay, now we know it's a Minecraft village. And he's not talking to me anymore. Got it. Cool, okay. Well, we have a Portal 2-esque potato companion, so that's pretty, pretty cool. And we also have a quest. Uh, oh! For anyone who's not familiar with my skin, it is uh, Zeus in jorts, and now he has this. I can take him off. Let's find a Minecraft village. Okay, okay, so I can just talk to him whenever he's on my head. Well, I guess I'll leave him up there for now, but otherwise, I guess I'll kind of just play some Minecraft until I find a village? Um, starting with, I suppose, wood and all that. Well, I mean, <laughs> y'all know how to play Minecraft, so I guess I'll kind of skip until I find a village. Or, I don't know, maybe there'll be something else interesting to find. We'll see. Man, this is actually a great place to start, I'm not going to lie. I'm getting tons of coal, and your boy's about to get some iron, if I just alley you. You see how much coal is in this freaking mountain? Look at all that. Damn. Damn. All right, well, it has become night, so I do need to be a bit careful now. Wait, what is that? That's, that is not a normal zombie. Hold on. Hold on a minute. I'm not going to rush over there. Oh, God. Oh, God. Did he destroy my crafting table? He did. Okay, Uh, we're fine. We're fine. Give me a sec. Give me a sec. I did get some iron, but I haven't smelted it yet, so I just need a crafting table real quick. Real quick. Damn, there's a lot of coal here. Uh, okay, and then we're just gonna do this, 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 and we're good, baby. Get back, fiend! There we go, there we go. Oh, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna leave you here, and I'm gonna get you cooking a bit of food for now. But, I wanna see what's up with that 
That's, yeah, I mean, that's not a normal zombie over there. It's like gold, not gold. It's almost like pumpkin -y. Is that a potato zombie? Can they just, like, spawn? Oh, uh oh okay, I actually have to really be careful here. Skeletons are not gonna be chill with this current situation. And we're fine. I still wanna see that. Okay, he's coming over here, that's, that's good, that's good. We can lure him away from the danger. Kill his normal friend. Hello, sir. You are a poisonous potato zone. Oh! Did... Did bro... Oh my god, he says potato. Potato! 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 And he dropped two poison... Oh, he dropped a poisonous potato plant. Oh, interesting. I wonder if I can do anything with extra of these. Holy shit, though. That, <laughs> that is crazy. That is crazy. He says potato. Every time you hit him, he says potato. That's crazy. Are all zombies in the potato bio or potato dimension gonna, gonna say potato? That is so funny. Okay, well, I'm just gonna smelt up some food, smelt up a bit of iron. Uh, kind of wait this night out, and then I'll get moving. We really need to find a village now. I'm getting antsy to see this dimension. Oh, shit. I see another potato zombie. I probably should be being pretty careful here. I don't want to die or anything, but... <laughs> I couldn't resist. Potato. <laughs> potato. God, I almost feel bad. They're kind of cute saying potato over and over again. What a what a dumb creature they are. Man, this update's great so far. Oh, hey Mr. Armadillo. I forgot they added you guys. Make some wolf armor out of you. Or out of the thing they drop, right? I don't think you actually have to kill them to get the, the little shell part off of them. You're awfully cute. Well, I guess I'm glad I uh, have the new update stuff in or I wouldn't have this little friend. Either way, still no village, but... I guess I'll be hoping for a savannah village. It's probably the easiest way to explore. I should probably also make a bed. Oh, that's much better. All right, now I can explore in peace and perhaps also get a little bit of food. Oh shit, oh, it's some of the new wolves too. Oh cool, did I get any bones? No, that is unfortunate. Hey boys, oh man, you look sweet. I love the new wolves. I have uh, messed around with them a bit. I've seen these ones, but they're, man, these gotta, gotta be some of my favorites out of the, all the new ones. Cool. Well, if I had bones, I'd befriend you, but I simply do not. I am a boneless, gelatinous slime, unfortunately. Oh, aha, I believe I have spotted. Yep, there it is. That, my friends, is a Minecraft village. Let's see what our potato friend has to say about this now. Hmm. Looks like a pretty standard... Oh! Did I say take a bed? Wait, what? What happened? By the way. Oh, I jumped. Shit. What do you think of this year's April Fool's joke? What, the update? I preferred the one where you could only pick up a single block. That was a good one. That was a good one. I was tempted to try to beat that one. But this year, I think they nailed it. Honestly... We'll see. I'm kind of thinking so, too. Potatoes! Indeed. Hilarious, it would seem. Anyways, I'm genuinely interested in your thoughts. Thinking. I'm trying to read your thoughts, but I don't think we are communicating with telepathy. Okay, good to know. At least two-way telepathy. This feels rather unidirectional. That's true. I cannot speak. And then you jump every now and then. Right. Well, that's to get you to keep talking. I am only assuming that jumping is a sign of acknowledgement. Well, that's what I was told, frankly, so uh, that would make sense. Perhaps I could modify your inventory. What? You should hopefully have some paper on you. Oh, I okay, I do. Paper, write your thoughts on the April Fool snapshot. Okay. This is just a piece of paper. Oh, wait, you need an anvil, too. Uh, I can, okay. Oh! Dude, <laughs> this is a full, like, I mean, it's a full, like, story mode in Minecraft, okay? Use that anvil to write your thoughts on the paper. I'll, okay, um, write my thoughts on the paper. How, uh, long can I make this? I have no idea. That seemed pretty long. Okay, um, dear, that's doctor. We'll say dear... Minecraft. I think 
this update is pretty radical. Pretty rad. That's all I can do. You know what? Dear Minecraft, I think this update is pretty rad. Done and done. I wasted a whole level on that, so I hope you're happy, Potato Man. But Potato... Potato Man? Can I take the anvil? Alright. I did find some golden armor, and I, uh... Uh, uh, dilapidated portal or whatever. So wait, what? Did he just, he just want me to do that? He's not going to say anything else? Weird. Okay. Wait, is there anything interesting about the village? Like, why did he want us to even... Oh! Well, that's not normally there. Excuse me. That is a poisonous potato on... An altar of some kind? Okay, I can't do anything with it. Does it want a poisonous potato? Or should I maybe here? Maybe I'll give it this one. What do you think of this? Oh, okay, nothing. Maybe it does want a normal poisonous potato? Oh! Just as I thought, a portal. I did forget his accent for a second. That's my bad. I think you know what happens next. I'm gonna guess I jump in. You're going to waltz on in there, find a dragon, and destroy some potato-themed crystals. A dragon? Wait. Can you actually- wait, is there like a potato ender dragon? Don't go in there, dude. You do not want to go in there. Wait, a potato-themed ender dragon? Okay, maybe we can actually beat this. That would be cool. That could be fun. This- this snapshot is dripping with creativity. Yeah, you could say that. Luckily, lucky that I am here to provide commentary and context, yeah? Lucky? Yeah? I mean, I guess I wouldn't know what to do if you weren't here, so... And that's it. Okay, well... <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, I think without any further ado, it's time for us to enter the potato dimension. Uh, which is all I can assume this is. Is there anything else I want to do while in the overworld? I guess I could collect some hay for some extra food. I got a decent amount of meat, though, so I think we're probably fine. Alright, alright. Okay, 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 uh, okay, okay, let's do this. Let's do I don't know why I'm scared. Let's just let's just go it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Take me to potato land Bon voyage non plus ultra at last the potato dimension at last the potato dimension. Holy shit Dude, oh god, don't eat me. Does something smell starchy to you? Yeah, I think it's this fucking guy. Holy shit. Can I trade with you? No. Whoa. Wait, are these all just potatoes? Oh. Perhaps not. Interesting. Dude, holy shit. I can't believe they made a whole last dimension for this update. I think you need to change your shampoo. Alright, bro. It's not me that smells, brother. Brother bear. It's certainly not me that smells like a potato in potato land. Normal ass iron golem, that's hilarious. Am amidst the potato people. So many unique blocks, too. Like, what is this? Terre de pomme. Oh, that's French for Earth of Potato? Right? Something like that? <laughs> I am I am feeling quite greasy up here. Alright, brother. Maybe it's because you're a goddamn potato. I don't know what to tell you. But I know uh pomme de terre. Isn't that um Apple? Or no, is palm de terre a potato? And palm is apple, so it's apple of the earth? It's something like that. I don't know. I took a little bit of French. Hello. Ah. Great. Great. Good thing I can get poisonous potatoes from you guys. Okay, so this is essentially dirt, I guess. Is this... Wait, is this a potato pig? Let's focus on the task at hand. Oh my god, it's a potato pig. Hey! Oh, he's got... What are, you, what are you looking at me like that for, bro? Brother literally, oh, <laughs> bro, he's, he literally hits me with the stank eye. Ooh, don't get me with that smolder pork chop shit. What is he gonna drop? Fucking pork chops? Okay, just pork chops. What do you want, potato man? Oh, it's becoming night. Um, can I sleep? Oh, okay. I sleep now. I sleep. Good night. All right, potato. Are you still talking to me? Yes. This place looks rather tragic. Tragic? I thought this was your homeland. Don't just insult the good people of b the potato dimension like that. Have you seen the animals? Yeah, bro. They gave me the rock stare down. 
Uh, okay, more poisonous potatoes. Could have figured. Could have figured. The baby poison or baby potato people. <laughs> wow, they got it all here. The Minecraft pig is looking pretty cheeky. Ah, uh, cheeky's a word for it. Amber gem. What? So there's a new ore? What? <laughs> okay, cool. And so is the cow. Very cheeky. I haven't seen a cow yet, but I can imagine they look cheeky. Those horses look normal. Awesome. You're in a potato village. Yep. I spawned here, it would seem. Oh, what is this? This will be your base of operations from here on out. Oh, this is where we're living? All right. I could, I could put up shop here. Familiarize yourself with the villagers. Oh, buddy. I am. What the hell? This is like a whole... This looks so modded. This is insane. Okay, that's just that. What is this? That's just a potato in a... Okay, item frame. Okay. Can I, like, cook a potato with this? Um... Something telling me it's not cooking. Oh! Ah, there we go. So is this like a new campfire type of deal? Because this thing looks sick. You just wanted me to, wait, familiarize myself with the villagers? Steal their loot, etc. Ah, the usual Minecraft stuff. Yeah, the usual video game stuff, I suppose. You always take the loot. Are you going to bake anytime soon, Brother Bear? What's, what's happening? Why are we, it's just, okay, I guess I'll come check back up on that soon. Hmm, okay. Well, you don't have anything. Uh, I've talked to you already. I think I've talked to all the villagers. Perhaps. There's some neat stuff around here, I guess. Like what? Most of it is potato themed. That would seem to be the case, yes. Okay, he can give me some bread, I guess. That's At least that's not potato themed. Why is, yeah, why is Amber just randomly here? As long as you think potatoes are neat, you'll be right at home. Well, brother, do I have good news for you. I love potatoes. Oh, there it goes. It did cook. Cool, cool, cool. Once you're ready, throw another one of those potato eyes. What? Once you're ready, throw another one of those potato eyes? What? Oh, okay, he's not talking to me anymore. Okay, well, I think we're on our own, at least for now. That's very interesting. He said he wanted us to make our base of operations here. God, there's so many potato plants. Oh, and these, okay, so some of them do actually have potatoes. Okay, cool, 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 cool. How many can I make on the uh, the old frying pan? Solid four. Okay, okay. I'll take that. So what? Oh, oh, we're above the clouds. Damn, we must be high up as hell. Was oh, that a, I do see some potato cows over there. Well, hmm, I'm interested. So obviously there's no roof. There's a, what I can only imagine is the great potato in the sky. So is... Like, what's beneath us? Is there a potato ocean that we are above? Like, there's also... So this is the dirt. That's palm de terre. Or terre de palm. What is this? Oh. Oh, good lord. That noise is the worst. How do you break it? Is there a good way to break it? The iron pickaxe does not seem to be working very well. Nor does anything. Oh, god. The noise. It's like stirring mac and cheese. And it doesn't even drop anything. Okay. Interesting. Are there going to be particular tools I need? Ew, dude. What the hell? There's potatoes everywhere, so you don't have to worry about food. But what are those things? Ew, dude. Oh, the butt skewer plants. What, is, what are you? Potato sprouts. God, my inventory is already so full. These look like dripstone, but do they damage me? Okay, they definitely do. Can I break them? Sounds, sounds like wood. Oh. Okay, can break. Potato bud. This is a potato bud? Okay, so we have gigantic spear potatoes. Oh, God. It's just the void. Oh, so we're on, like, floating islands. Like, is that a... Okay, there's a phantom down there as well. Where am I? What is happening, Mojang? What is this? What is that? Is that a kitty? Oh my god, is that a kitty? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Potato kitty has been spotted. This takes precedent. Potato kitty! Oh my god, it is! Come here. Come here! Oh, I'm gonna die if I'm not careful. Oh, oh god, okay, yep, 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 yep. Definitely not gonna fuck with a witch right now. Uh, actually, we probably need to get the hell out of here. Is she distracted? Okay, she might be stuck. Well, Potato Kitty, unfortunately, is in cahoots with the witch. I suppose that does make sense in hindsight. 
We have no shortage of potatoes. Does make sense. Oh. Oh, this is where the phantom was, wasn't it? Oh, shit. And there are trees, but, like, I mean... Oh, 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 slowness. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Fuck, 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 fuck. Ugh. Okay, well, I'm gonna be at one heart for a while. Um, man, I am so unorganized, too. Okay, well, these things are everywhere. I don't have to keep them. Potato. Why are these potatoes not stacking? Okay, that I don't know. I'm gonna throw away those. Let's eat, uh, do I have any, oh, I don't have any good food. Okay, we're just gonna start eating potatoes then. Just raw, whole potatoes, just like God intended, God damn it. And as we slowly let this poison wear off, while hopefully nothing kills us, uh, I did sleep, so we will respawn in the potato dimension, so I would say the, uh, the potato dimension challenge, you could say, has officially begun. I do want to try to beat this now, ever since I heard of the potato dragon and the potato crystals, was it? Uh, yeah, I, I want to beat this shit, for sure. Here, let's fuel up a little bit more, and let's see what's up with this wood. Is this actual wood? Oh. New recipes unlocked. Okay, potato stem. Potato planks. Yeah, okay, no, nothing there is particularly surprising. Um, can I make s normal sticks? Okay, normal sticks, that's good. We could probably look at our recipes. Potato peeler, plus 10 damage to potato mobs? Whoa, oh, I could make that. Unless, shit, I'm actually, that's sick that I made shears earlier, unless I can't use the, oh, I can! Come at me, bro. Where's this potato zombie at? Oh, that's a normal zombie. Oh, never mind. You aren't potato-themed. I do not care about you. Well, we got a potato peeler. Um, I guess it's probably worth keeping my sword because not all, as we just saw, not all mobs here are, in fact, potato-themed. Uh, what do I want to even throw away right now? I guess a singular glowstone is not going to do much for me. Okay. So we got potato planks. Hold on, let's keep looking. Potato eye. Oh. Okay, we just make poisonous potatoes. Oh, these are like ender eyes? Okay, cool, cool, cool. So this is what... Oh, God. Why are there phantoms everywhere? That is so not chill. At least they don't see me. But if they do, I'm fucking screwed. We might have to... Oh! Okay. Oh, I put away my potato... Fuck, I put away my potato peeler. Hold on. We gotta go raw on this boy. Potato skeleton encountered. They have potato everything here. Um, did I pick up? Okay, let me grab the bones instead of, instead of, instead of three sticks. And let's just real quick, um, oh, is this a potato cave? Oh, this is a full-on potato cave, I see. Okay, you know what? We're just going to try to post up here for just a sec. It is kind of scary. I don't have anything good to mine this with, whatever this stuff is. Oh, what? Okay, okay, apparently zombies spawn in hordes here, so that's a, a new development. Can I make it back to the village? I should not have come down here. I saw a kitty, dude. What, you, what did you expect me to do, bro? You show me kitty, man. Oh, I heard a potato. Oh, fuck me. Back up, you potato-themed fiend. I heard someone say potato up there, bro. I ain't gonna get spooked by this. Uh, okay, hold on. We might have to do some parkour to get our way up here. Huh. Let's go this way. I'm going to try to veer away from that. Oh, there are different types of potato grass as well. Multiple potato biomes, perhaps. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Run from phantoms. Oh, they burn in the daylight. That is something that is at least good. So during the day, we shouldn't be too worried about the phantoms. Okay. Maybe that means there might be like a potato elytra as well. That would be cool. All right, here, I'm going to use some potato planks just to... Oh, that's fine. That works. Is that enough? The phantoms make terrifying noises. I don't think I ever even realized. Well, the screech, obviously, but just the wing flap, I think it is, is also scary. Okay, let's go back to the potato village. And let's just... I guess we will actually make base in the potato village or at least maybe we'll maybe we'll build like a potato house god the potato fields are huge wow this land is magical man i'm, I'm not even gonna front about it this is this is pretty much a dream scenario for me right now not that i like i mean i love potatoes for sure not that i'm the biggest potato fan in the world but like this is hype everything's green i love green i also love purple does this guy also have the goddamn rock eyebrows 
Okay, he doesn't at least... You got, he's got the goatee, which is sick. But he at least doesn't stare me down. Okay, here. We could make base in here. It's pretty small. I guess we'll want to probably build our own house because we might as well try to use the potato blocks and such just for funsies. But at least for now, let's just set up in here. The potato doors are sick. Okay, nice. Yeah, no bed in here. So we can theoretically... Oh! Um... No bed in here, so theoretically no one lives here. So that means we can just... I guess, you know what, let me just remove this rock and we'll throw our bed down. These potato bricks down here look pretty cool. They kind of look like they're covered in slime. Which is a little off-putting, off off, uh, unsettling, perhaps you could say. But I don't judge. Um, here, I'm going to remove... Oh, Oh, so this is more of that potato stone than... Why did none of my tools break this? There must be like, does the potato peeler break this? Wait, did it? No, 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 no. Okay, okay. Hold on. First things first. Let's throw down our crafting table. Let's build a chest. Unless, you know what? Let me. S I assume this is just going to make a normal chest. Okay. I just had to make sure there wasn't a potato chest that we could potentially be using. Would never ever miss a chance to build or use a potato chest okay now hold on let's all right i can't fucking break this shit um all right i'll put you here fine i'll put the furnace over here easy peasy now let's dump some stuff in here okay let's just kind of dump everything for now and feels kind of funny that we even have that but there there's my uh review i don't know if i'm i can do anything with that but let's just throw all of this in here. I guess I could wear this helmet. Uh, for now, I guess I won't because we kind of want him to keep talking to us. Let's get some potatoes cooking. Just throw... I guess we do have coal. Might as well. Throw that in there. We have a blast furnace. So that's cool if we have some ore. I guess we'll have to see what kind of ore is even here. But, okay. Let's let some food cook. Throw that in there. Uh, I'll put my potato peeler right there. Let's give a sleep. And let's just see what these potato eyes do. I think that might be a good place to leave the first episode. Is seeing... Where are these going to lead us? Oh, that way. Okay. On the road again. It'll be a battle against the ultimate potato. I s the ultimate potato. Is it a potato dragon? That's all the information I have. If I were to guess, it's probably a Maris Piper. Is that a, like a kind of potato? <laughs> I don't get that reference if it is, but okay. Known to be the most versatile of the potatoes. Really. It's worth going in with the right tools. Sharpen up some swords, boil up some potions. Some potions, okay, interesting. Don't forget to also cook up some potatoes. Don't worry, brother. Those are already going right inside. We're certainly not lacking for potatoes here. Yeah, you could say that again. Good lord, there is potatoes here. What are you doing? Are you going in my place? You going in there, bro? There's nothing in there. There's nothing of your concern in there, brother. What? What? What are you doing? Why do they like to chill in this corner? Okay, potato man's done talking to me. Well, I guess we know that the potato eyes are going to lead us this way. To theoretically a boss fight that is apparently a legendary potato. Those eyes are actually really simple to make, so we can kind of do that whenever we want, I guess. But we need to gear up first. Here, you know what? One last thing. Let's look at some more crafting recipes just to kind of see what else we can make. Um, a frying table. Okay, we can make this. Oh, cool. You need the little gold nugget? That's so cute. So we could have infinite food cooking. It does take a while. What? Poisonous potato chest plate? Potato peels. Interesting. Wait, how... Okay, how do you get potato peels? And there's all different colors, apparently. And then you can make a chest plate? That is awesome. So can I... Wait, can I peel a potato using... Um, here, right, let me actually... I'll let those all cook. Let's just go grab a couple potatoes. Can I, like, peel these? No. Okay, so I maybe when I attack a potato mob with the potato peeler, then it'll give me potatoes. Here, let's test it on the pig. Yes, okay, we got a pink potato peels. 
sick. Oh, wait, is it pink because it was a pig? Do, like, different mobs have different types of potato peels? Interesting. It might be worth starting, like, a potato pig farm. Dude, this is so cool. I mean, this is essentially, like, a full... This is gonna be, I think, like, a full modded playthrough of, like, a seemingly pretty in-depth mod. But no, it's just vanilla... It's just vanilla Minecraft. I really can't get over how funny it is. I do think Mojang outdid themselves for this one. And, uh, yeah, so far, my props, absolutely. Here, let's see what else. Is there anything else we can make? Okay. The poisonous potatoes, of course. Of course. Okay, similar recipe. Poisonous potato hammer. 11 attack damage with knockback 10? A blaze rod. In interesting so i wonder can you get blaze rods here by some other way are there, or are there blazes here or can you get to the nether from here all interesting questions this thing does 11 attack damage i really want this especially because it's a hammer and that's right up my alley potato sign of course poisonous politra oh wait you can just make it oh with the membranes okay cool so we can be flying all around this place. I mean, we won't have fireworks, theoretically. But still, I mean, with the void being down there and how much verticality there is in this biome, this dimension, that's pretty cool. Okay, cool. So we do need to collect phantom membranes. Good on that. We know that. What is this? A hot potato. Potato and a lava bucket makes a hot potato. Cool. Can't make that right now, but good to know. A painting? Wait, yeah, that's just a normal Minecraft painting. I don't know why that made me trip so much. Oh, you can make leather horse armor? That's not a normal Minecraft thing, is it? Potato battery? Iron, copper, redstone, and potatoes. What? Dude, there's, like, machinery? That's crazy. <laughs> Baked potato bricks. Okay, that makes sense. We could build a house out of that. Man, that is cool expired baked potato bricks okay so it's kind of like the mossy version that's cool poisonous potato block sure sure otherwise i think that's all we have at the moment cool well then um we certainly have a lot to do a lot to see a lot of potatoes to investigate but we have infinite food so we don't have to worry about that anymore we have a base so that's epic and in the next episode, assuming you guys want to see more, which I hope you do, because this is really cool so far. In the next episode, I guess we'll maybe make some potato armor. Maybe see if we can make one of the potato weapons, like the hammer. And then we'll also get started on building ourselves a potato mansion, because I feel like we might as well. There's some cool blocks here. There's also clearly a decent amount of biome, so we're just going to have to explore as well. Maybe we can make a map. We'll have to see if we can get paper here, I guess. We'll have to see what kind of ingredients we can get here in general. Who knows what we can actually get. But that'll be next time, everybody. For now, like, subscribe if you want more potato content. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, jankheads.